Oh my goodness, can I just tell you, Ikea is killing it. <sighs> I should feel ashamed, but I'm just gonna admit that I literally geek out and love. I just can't help it. Every time we talk about Ikea, I'm like, mm, Ikea. <laughs> Hello and welcome to the House of Valentina. I am so excited about today's video because we're doing some Ikea shopping for spring. I don't know about you, but I am having the time of my life this spring. I am just having so much fun getting my house prepped and primped and just ready for a new season. And I think Ikea is one of the best places to shop this time of year. They have so many things that you can use to really get your house ready for the season. They're super affordable and of course, super chic and designer approved. I know you're going to absolutely love today's video, so just go ahead and hit subscribe, give the video a big thumbs up, and of course, we wanna hear from you. Let us know which of these things are your favorite things from the Ikea list. We're gonna have a bunch for you to choose from. Yes, I've actually got my uh, little afternoon fika that I'm going to enjoy with you. Fika is a Swedish idea. If you've been to Ikea, you may have seen little things like this out. Fika is all about taking a break with your friends or someone that you just really want to recharge with. You can even do it by yourself, but for me, this is one of my favorite little things that we get to do here on the House of Valentina. We always have our coffee and our treats together, and I love this time with you, so I hope today getting to share my Ikea finds with you will be something that you'll enjoy and um, I'm gonna have my little latte and Jack has hooked me up I told him hey you know it's nice to have little treats for the mid-afternoon so he went shopping <laughs> which is always really dangerous these are Emmy's organics this is the one that's open it's the vanilla bites and I'm gonna eat those up really fast so I can get to the peanut butter ones so I'll leave links for the treats and uh, all the items that I'm showing to you today I'll leave them all linked down below that way you can shop online and also you can have a little list you can actually make a list on your phone if you log into your account it's a free little thing that Ikea offers you and you can actually have a shopping list I know I'm that geeky <laughs> and they are not even paying me to tell you this okay cheers you guys let's jump in the number one thing that you should have in your pot in your pot <laughs> The number one thing you should have in your cart are pots. <laughs> Planters are one of my favorite things to shop for at Ikea. I personally love when I get to go into the store because I love their plant section. They always have a really, really good selection of live plants. I like the trees that they sell and I like the different plants. I think that the faux section is pretty good, so if you're in need of something where there's a dark area or somewhere that's gonna, maybe if you've got a vacation home or a kid like I do that doesn't think to water stuff, check out their faux section as well. But the number one thing that you should definitely have in your cart if you're shopping from home are the planters, and they've got a couple of them. I really love the Apple Ross. That is so pretty with that little ribbing around that, oh. I can't even talk, it's so good. It's so pretty. I love the creamy color. I would really like to grab some of these and have some herbs growing in those. I think those would be perfect. Even on your kitchen counter, you could put them outdoors. They're gorgeous. And I love to have fresh herbs growing, especially in the springtime. And we're just having so much fun picking out what herbs would go in there. What would you pick? I would definitely have to have some thyme, some oregano, what else? Then I also love the Grad Vis. This is a six inch pot and for $8. And I hate that they're a little bit small. I wish that Ikea would come out with those in a bigger size. I think that they're beautiful. Again, I think that that sort of fluting on them is just gorgeous. And the colors are really neutral. It comes in several colors so you can match it to your decor. But I really do think that those can really add just a little extra something. Even if you're just adding something maybe to a desk or maybe your dresser or a bedside table, that's where you can use something that's maybe a little bit smaller and really get the impact out of it. Another plant that's really easy to grow in a pot like that is a pothos. So if you're just getting started and you're not sure what to plant in a planter in a, in a pot that size, think about a pothos. I think that will really be beautiful and you'll absolutely love that it is really low maintenance. <laughs> really low maintenance. If you kill one of those, 
you should probably not own plants. Okay, I'm just saying that. <laughs> Next up, you should absolutely have blankets in your Ikea cart. I love to switch up my blankets this time of year. I like to really lighten things, but it is still nice to have the softness and the coziness that a blanket provides. So Ikea has several that I think you should definitely be keeping your eye out for. I know I am. I love the Home V. That is so pretty. It comes in two colors. You could do the gray or that little sage green kind of color. And it's a nice big size. It's a 47 by 60 for only $7.99, oh my gosh, you've gotta be kidding me. That's such a great price. It's got the beautiful fringing, which will really add a lot of warmth and texture. But I gotta tell you, that one's really pretty, but they also have the Gunamore, and that is another one that is nice and big. It's a 51 by 67 inch. It's got the fringing as well. It's only $7.99. What are these people doing to me? Are they just insane? I love that creamy color. I think you can really just layer on neutrals like that, especially this time of year. So many of us are wanting to lighten and brighten things, especially as we are going into the summer. And I think that a blanket like this would look beautiful added to your bed, added to your sofa, or just thrown over your chair. It's just gorgeous. I don't know about you, but when spring hits, one of the first things that I do is I just go all around the house and I start changing all the sheets. I really like to change up all the bedding, actually. It's finally, winter is done and the flannels and the fleece and a lot of the heavier boo clay. I have loved it. <laughs> but I'm ready to leave it for a little while. So I like to pack those heavy things away and go through the house and switch up all the sheets to something that's a lot lighter. So I think your bedding is a really big thing that you should think about adding from Ikea because they've got, so, oh my gosh, you guys, they have so many affordable options. It's really hard to even just narrow it down. We've talked about so many of these great Ikea finds over the years. You can check out our entire Ikea playlist. In the meantime though, while you're adding things to your cart, definitely check out the Som Tuta sheet set. That is $64.99 for a king size and it comes in several colors and it's just a really nice, warm, creamy white color. So it's really nice and neutral, but it will keep your bed feeling warm. We're ready to layer on beiges and taupes and creamy whites and this sheet set is ideal and it's perfect. It's a neutral that's gonna literally last you for years. Also, oh, the Puda, Puder Vita. This linen duvet set is gorgeous. It comes in several colors, including a yellow, an, an orange, got green. Of course, I love neutrals, so I really love that gray color. For $119 for a king size, it's such a steal. It's such a great one to look for, and I just absolutely love it. So definitely think about adding some linen to your bed. And I think that you can add this kind of dark gray to your bed with a lot of whites. I'm actually doing that exact combination in my son's room. So definitely stay tuned, hit subscribe so you don't miss out when I give a little tour of his space ready for spring. But I also think that if you really want to lighten things up, Ikea has one more option that is awesome. And that is the Angs Lilia. That one is only $44.99 for a king size. It's such a good price. It's white, it's cotton, it's really light. It will really, really lighten the entire room. It'll really lighten the way that you feel in your bed. And I think that it would just be a little bit more crisp feeling than the linen. And so that's where you get to have all the fun. Like what's your personality? What's your, your sleep personality? And how do you like to rest? I think that either one of those duvet covers would be amazing paired with that sheet set. And it's just gonna help you feel really just cozy, but also like, I don't know, it's like spring, summer. You know that feeling where you're just like, everything's light and airy and everything feels possible. That's what I love about these kinds of things. It really just makes it all just feel, you wake up to it and you go to sleep to it. And I think that's what I love so much about it. Oh my goodness. Can I just tell you, Ikea is killing it in their outdoor rug section. They have got so many good options. I've had the hardest time narrowing this down. Just go check out their outdoor rugs. I think right now is the perfect time to definitely be thinking about updating your outdoor areas. They do have a few doormats. 
which are very, very nice. But my favorite thing that they have right now are definitely the outdoor rugs. And they have a couple that really jumped out at me. I absolutely love the Morum. That's a, it's basically seven by 10 and 119. And it's just a really, really great neutral. I think a lot of times our outdoor rugs can just get a little bit dingy, of course, because they're outdoors, right? Cleaning them up or getting one new can really just really elevate your entire space and help it just to feel really put together and clean and neat and ready for that new season. They also have the Virklund for only $59.99 for a five by seven and I love that stripe. I think it's such a classic. It never goes out of style. It has a little bit of pattern, especially if you have a solid color uh, set, maybe for your patio furniture. I think something like this can really just add a little bit of interest and depth to your entire space and oh, it's gorgeous. I love it. They also have the Lobach. This is a uh, two by six and it's $39.99. I, I love that it's got the chevron pattern. I just think that is such a fun little piece. I really, really love that. If you've got space for it, please just grab it and put it in your cart because I think you'll love it. <laughs> Let's move to the one thing that pretty much none of us wants to do, but it's something we have to do, so we might as well make it pretty and fun if possible, and that is updating our cleaning supplies. These are things you should absolutely have in your cart. They will make spring cleaning so much more fun because let's face it, if we have a beautifully decorated home and it's dirty, yeah, it's just not as great. So why not make cleaning fun? <laughs> At least that's how I think about it. One of my favorite finds of all time from Ikea are the, uh, how do you pronounce this? Marianthiris, Marianthiris, Marianthiris. <laughs> These are the little washcloths. In fact, I've got some, hang on, I'm gonna show them to you. I bought a couple packs of these when I was at Ikea a few times ago. So we've had them for a while and I love these. I absolutely love them. This is gonna be one of those things that I just recommend in like every single video because they are such a great little cleaning cloth. I love the little pattern in them. I like the fact that when they're sitting out on the counter, they just look a little bit organic and yet somehow kind of chic. I don't even know how they do that, but they do. And they even have the little tab, so you can actually hang them maybe over your knob or if you wanna add a hook like they did in the picture, you can do that. But we use these all the time as cleaning cloths. I use them to wipe up spills. If we're gonna spray down the counter or the table, we use them for everything. And they are super high quality. And for a pack of two, only $6.99. Ooh, ooh, what are the other things? I'm not gonna grab everything I've got in my house because I have a lot of these things. But the other thing that I bought recently at Ikea that I've ended up absolutely loving are their little scrub brushes because they have the wooden handles and the little bristles and they're actually, not only are they really effective, but they look really pretty sitting by the sink. So now I just buy them in bulk because whenever I'm gonna be staging a home, whether it's a home to sell or we're decorating and we're getting ready to maybe film and show you guys and we have a new homeowner that's just moving in, I think that a really nice little scrub brush like that is not only practical, but it's pretty. And I love when those things can do double duty. Yes, I said duty. Just busy yourselves. I said double duty. The next thing that you should absolutely have on your list for Ikea is the tools. It's one of those things that a lot of people don't realize that they even sell at Ikea. When we lived overseas and we were in Copenhagen, we would always be at Ikea because there was one so close to our house and it was so easy to get there. And so we were pretty often. And so we actually owned a lot of their tools. We were just getting started. We had literally nothing. We didn't even know where to even find a a hardware store when we first arrived, but we knew where the Ikea was. So we actually stocked up on a lot of these things. They have an entire Fixa collection. And we have found that these are really, really great items to just have in stock. I like the fact that they all match. You can have them look really neat and tidy in your workshop area or out in your garage, or if you're gonna have them maybe underneath the sink. We've had the drill, we've had the hammer, the screwdrivers, they've got uh, great sets with all the little screws, the nails, They've kind of got it all. Oh, if they even got a laser level, they've got it all. And I think that these are great things to have in your shopping cart because when you're doing spring cleaning, a lot of times you end up 
like us, we're patching walls, we're hanging things, we're tidying, and I think it's really nice to have a neat little storage of just some tools and things that you're gonna be wanting to use in your house. Another thing that you just need to have in your cart are pillows. I love to go throughout the entire house and switch up all the pillows. And if you've gotten really smart and you've bought the inserts, which are also sold at Ikea for a very good price, I think that you can just very easily take the covers off and switch them and have like a, just a little drawer with some little covers in them and you just pull them out year after year. Every season you kind of switch them up. I love it. So this time of year, I love to lighten things up. I love the Maj Brocken cushion cover. It's a 20 by 20 for only $4.99. It comes in five colors. You could go creamy, you could add some blues if you wanna add some blues and whites. There's some really great options. It's a really, really nice woven material that's also really light and airy. If you're craving color and a little bit of pattern, check out the Coost Ply. Again, 20 by 20, a nice big size pillow. It's $12.99 and it is super cute. I also love the Plomarn, Plomon Ross. <laughs> That's only $5.99 for a 20 by 20 and it comes in a light and a dark shade. And these little patterns can really just kind of balance out if you have a lot of solids. So definitely think about updating your pillows. I think it's perfect to update them on the sofas, on your chairs, and I love to even switch them out on the beds and have a couple little throw pillows because it just gives you this new, fresh feeling and it's a few bucks. And I just think, oh, it's just, it makes such a big difference. Now is the perfect time to be thinking about your garage area and Ikea has some really, really great items that can really help your garage look amazing, but definitely don't have to break the bank because I don't know about you, the garage is an, an area that I personally tend to invest a lot of money in, but since we see it every time we pull the car in and out, it is nice to have that. And you don't even have to have a garage. Maybe you have a storage closet or you've got a basement area. And I think these are the perfect finds to help you get those areas organized for the spring season. Definitely check out the Bro Collection. This is, that's the word for brother in Danish. I don't know if that means anything. Let's make the garage look amazing with this collection. You can customize it to your space. You can decide if you want it to go all the way to the ceiling, if you need some lower shelves, you've got closed storage options. There really are just about any option you could possibly need. And I am definitely eyeing this for my own garage because mine is a mess. Cause that's my husband's area. <laughs> I've saved my personal favorite for last and that is closet organization. I, I should feel ashamed, but I'm just gonna admit that I literally geek out and love, love switching up my wardrobe for spring and I love going through all throughout the house, the kids, my husband and everybody's closets. I just love organizing the closets and the drawers and getting the wardrobe ready for a new season. I love the act of trying things on, you know, organizing what's gonna stay, what's gonna go, what gets packed. It's just so much fun. And when you have a few little tools, in your tool bag, it can really make it even more fun. So a couple of things that you should definitely have in your basket for your closet organization. There are so many good ones. Ikea is the perfect place to go to get your closet organized. But I do highly recommend the Scoob set. I own them and they are in every single drawer of my entire house. I love these things. I love the fact, and I've tried some from other places like Amazon, I still prefer the Ikea ones because they are like a waterproof nylon kind of material and they are just indestructible. I've owned mine for absolutely years. At one point, I finally took the white ones out because I had a black dresser and I was like, I'm gonna treat myself to the black ones because it owned the white for so long that I was like, man, I just want some, I just want a different color. It wasn't because they'd worn out. They just literally last forever and they really can just help you just get your Marie Kondo vibes going and just really just, you know, fold your socks and watch your favorite YouTuber, <laughs> which is hopefully me, <laughs> and get your spaces organized and oh, I love it. I love it. That'll be my second career is uh, doing organization. I just think it's so much fun. I also have in my own closet, the Kvarnik boxes. 
I love those boxes. They look like linen, but they're super sturdy and they have like a really, really thick cardboard material inside of them and they just hold up. I own some in my office. I have them in the closet. They're ideal. They come in different sizes, so depending on what you need to store. I've got the nice big ones and that's where I'll put maybe some shoes and I've stacked some of the jeans and some of the heavier uh, trousers that I wanna store for the spring and summer and they're perfect. It's perfect for storing in your closet because they look really pretty, but they aren't kind of, they're not gonna cost you very much. They are around $12.99 a box. So yeah, just go get them. I have them in gray and beige, both colors, gorgeous. I love them. Then while we're organizing, let's talk about some baskets. We can't organize without pretty baskets and Ikea has a couple that are beautiful. They've got the Innsvep which is only $34.99, and I think that seagrass material is beautiful. Also check out the Gega, that one's only $24.99. I use that style for toys, for laundry. I love the fact that it has a handle on it so you can carry it from room to room. A lot of times, even still, even though Landon is 13 now and the kids are getting older, it is nice to have a little toy bed and you can just carry it wherever he wants to play. I also use those for blanket storage and you can just move them around the house. They're perfect. <sighs> I know, it was a bit of a whirlwind, but I can't help it. I just get so excited about Ikea. I just love it. And I feel like you guys love it too because you, you tell us down in the comments all the time that you just love the Ikea videos. And what I love so much about Ikea is that it really is in alignment with our personal ethos. And that is a democracy of design and that everyone deserves to have a beautiful home. And it's accessible. It's accessible, it's beautiful. It definitely gives you a very designer, high-end look to your home. And I just, I love it. I love it. So I hope that you've had fun in today's video. I know that I have, and I didn't even drink my coffee and I was this hyper. I just can't help it. Every time we talk about Ikea, I'm like, yeah, Ikea. <laughs> it's, why does it have to be so good? Oh, so I hope you've enjoyed today's video. Please hit subscribe and give the video a big thumbs up. We just love that we have this global community that we just get to hang out and chit chat about, you know, uh, little treats and coffees and have a fika together and chat about Ikea. It's amazing. So thank you so much for stopping in and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.